Hi, I'm Jim Ritchie from Instron, and I'm here at the MD&M East Show in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. And I'm wanting to tell you a little bit about some new products that we've got on display here today at the exhibition and conference. Um, one of the reasons we brought some of this equipment here is being driven by things that are happening out there in the real world. There's standards committees and regulatory agencies around the world that are driving medical device manufacturers to produce testing results that are more physiologically correct and more physiologically like the actual environments their products are going to be used in. So with that, we brought a couple of new uh, systems here to talk about today to show you how Instron is helping those device manufacturers meet those new regulations. The first one is this BioBox. Uh, you'll notice it's encapsulating an Instron 5944 test system uh, to allow you to actually do testing at body temperature, 37 degrees Celsius. Um, uh, I think the first and most important thing to do is to actually see how a test would be run inside this chamber, and I'll tell you a little bit about it as it happens. So first we would open the lower door, very nicely ergonomically designed to allow folks to get in here and put their specimens in the grips. I've got a suture material that I'm putting on these cord and yarn grips. I clamp the bottom one, the top one first. I clamp the bottom one next. These are pneumatically driven. I close the door. You can see that we're actually performing the test at 37 degrees C. I use our Blue Hill 3 software, click the start button, and you start to see a stress strain curve as the grips move apart to test the strength of the material. Here it's going up, you see the curve going up, and within a few seconds it's going to break. As it's just done, I click OK. The crosshead returns again, allowing for very quick turnover in testing. And you can see our specimen broke at about 10 pounds, or around 50 newtons. Um, the BioBox is a great solution for a variety of reasons, but most of them are the ones that are benefiting our customers, providing high accuracy temperature control, plus or minus two degrees Celsius, putting the entire test space inside the chamber so you can get the full travel at temperature of your specimen uh, along with the kind of ergonomic layout that makes it very easy for the customers to move in and out to perform their testing. The most powerful way to show the bio box is to actually see it in action. So we're going to actually run a test. I've loaded the specimen into the grips, the cord and yarn grips, and now I'm going to click on the start button and you can actually see on the productivity panel the load increasing. Down below, uh, with our temperature controller, you can see that all of the testing is actually happening at 37 degrees C, which is body temperature, and now the test is complete. So the Instron BioBox is that first solution. Now the second system that I'd like to talk about in the spirit of the physiologically correct testing is our new Electropulse system. Uh, this is the Instron E1000 system. Uh, we come, it comes in three different flavors, uh, a one kilonewton version like this one, a three kilonewton version, and a 10 kilonewton version. Uh, so the one that we've got actually uh, testing our smarts here today, testing the, the brain, is the E1000. Um, it's a very unique system uh, in that it uses all electric, uh, no cooling water required, no hydraulics, uh, linear motor technology built into the crosshead, uh, very, very strong lateral stiffness, uh, and uh, high frequency response for high performance types of tests. Again, typically used to simulate uh, real life types of tests. As we know, for example, uh, the FDA requires stent manufacturers to uh, actually run their stents through 400 million cycles. That's 10 years worth of uh, cycles on their products. And you could use a system like this to do exactly that. So now focusing down in the workspace, there's a lot of interesting uh, benefits built into the uh, test system down here. First, you can see on the base, we've got an integrated T-slot table, which allows customers to uh, orient their specimens or their products in a unique way to, to perform their tests. Uh, what you can see actually happening is we have the actuator going up and down. We have one of our Instron Dyna cells with uh, the unique patented technology that eliminates inertial effects uh, from high frequency types of tests to give you the true, true test loads that are happening down in your specimen. Here, uh, you actually have a brain being tested, but it's not a real brain, just uh, to be clear. It's just a, a little toy simulation uh, for this particular type of test. Um, and again, uh, focusing on the ergonomics, one of 
the most important features of this revolutionary new product, the Electropulse, is a, a lot of the, uh, both the ergonomic and the safety uh, features that are built into the system. I've got the handset here that we can use to actually uh, start the tests. We have the emergency stop button in case uh, there was something uh, in the actual setup that would require an emergency stop. We can depress that to actually stop the test. And then actually from an ergonomic point of view, up above here, if you can span up, you actually see the mechanical drive system which allows us to automatically set the height of the test and then an electric motor that allows you to actually just automatically lift the crosshead to accommodate different specimen sizes. Uh, you know, a great, great, great feature. And then over here on the left, here we actually have our Instron Wave Matrix software which is used on the Electropulse systems to perform uh, both the simulation and fatigue types of tests. Uh, you see the multiple graph displays that have been configured on here to allow you to look at everything from uh, things like energy uh, per cycle or forces or stress and strain. At the very top, you have this visual feedback all the time of exactly what's going on, the loads that you're actually seeing on the tests, the displacements that are happening, uh, and the frequency uh, at which you're running. Again, that's all fully configurable by the operator though. On the left side, of the screen, you actually see our console software. And one of the important elements of that, aside from just all of the uh, configuration that you would do in the system, is there's a color code in here. And you see that it's green on the software system. And then as you would pan across and look at the front of the machine, you would also see a matching green light. What that provides is from a distance, you can actually see that this system is in operation. Green means go. It's actually running the test. Uh, you know, so when it comes to fatigue testing, uh, nothing out there could, uh, could top our, our wonderful new Electropulse product.